Hello friends, Tony here, welcome. Uh, in this video I'm going to work with pagination. Right now we have some posts here and I want to display only uh, six posts per page. And also when we create a new post, yeah, we send the email that the post is created, but we redirect the uh, post index page and we need to scroll and see where the post is. So I'm going to display a flash message saying that the post is created successfully. Okay, so let's start and work with that. Let's open the VS Code and the first thing, I'm going to open the post controller. Okay, here on the index method we say in post all, but instead of that we can use the paginate method. And here we need to specify the number, how many posts we need to display. So in my case I'm going to say 6. And right now if I save just by adding that and come here, as we can see, we have some posts here, all the posts, but if I refresh, now we have only six of them. Good. Now we need some uh, links here, uh, pagination to click to navigate the, the second page and so on. And how we can do that? Let's come here and on the post index page, so let's open the index. Inside the post, we make a for each and let me just close like this. We make a for each after the for each. I'm going to add a div and let's add the class to be margin top of uh, six. And inside this, I'm going to add double curly braces, dollar sign post variable. And because now we use this pagination, paginate method, we have also a links method available to us. So we can chain the post the links method and if I save just by saying that thing come here and yeah we have previous and next refresh click on next we navigate the next page next page as you can see page number three previous and previous also if you want more you can go to tilewindconfig.js and here you can add this so vendor Laravel framework, source, illuminate pagination, resources, views, blade. Okay, save that. And then you need to run the npm run dev, of course. And with that, now we have this nice uh, pagination. Okay, so we, we can click directly to page number three, page number one, and so on. Good, so that is the pagination. So very easy with Laravel. Now let's display a flash message when we create a new post. Okay, and for that we need again to go to post controller and let's scroll down when we store a new post. We create the post, yeah, we dispatch a job and then we return to the route post index. When we return there, I'm going to say return with a message or a status or what you like. So this is the key, the first step. One is a key and then the value. The key, I'm going to name it a message that is going to be stored on the session. And the second is going to be the value. So the message, which I'm going to say uh, post created successfully. Okay, like this. With that, now we need to display that because right now if we create that is not going to be displayed. We need to display on the post index. We return to the route post index. Let's go to the index. And here I'm going to render the message. For that, I'm going to use the flow byte, this success alert. And let me just copy that. Here we have, let's copy and paste it here. Right now, if I save and just let's see this, I'll go to post index page, yeah, this is the alert I'm going to say also here to be margin bottom 4 and margin top of uh, 6. Come here, yeah, we have 6, okay. Then, uh, instead of displaying always, because if I refresh, yeah, this is going to be displayed, I'm going to display only when we create a new post. So for that, I'm going to cut this and put in the if statement. So say if and use a session. We have a helper session method. And here we need to specify the key. We added here message. So if you have add something else, pass that. So let's say message if 
the session has a message, I'm going to display this. And now, in the success alert, instead of the hard-coded, I'm going to say double color braces, again use the session helper method, pass the key, which is, in my case, message. And this one I'm going to remove. Okay, so we say if the session has a message, display this div and pass in the session message here. Go to refresh. As you can see, we don't see now that, but let's go and create a new post. Use fake filler. Choose the image here and say store. We are redirected back and now we have this post created successfully. Very good. Let's do the same thing also on the update. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to copy this and scroll down. When we update, we turn to the route post show. And here also, we're going to do the same thing, return with the message. Now here, I'm going to say post, uh, post updated. successfully okay save now we need to go to post show page and do the same thing we have done here and you can do that but instead of this i'm going to cut this and move this logic on the layout so let's open the layout and here so the nav bar i'm going to paste this session if check session okay good now let's create a new post and see so this, I'm going to say, Rogan post, just to see this belong to this user. Store, the post created successfully. Yeah, we have the flash message. And just let's see now where the post is. Yeah, Rogan post is here. Click here and we don't see the edit and delete button. And we don't see that because we need to go to post policy. Because here, when we add this before, I changed the return to false. This means only the admin can uh, edit and delete posts. Here we say we have a boolean or null. If we return null here, and I do that just to show you, if we return null and refresh, now we have the edit and delete and this is only for the Orogan post okay so if i click here we don't see the edit and delete okay let's go to edit and let's say updated if we say updated choose update we redirect back the post show page and we have now post updated successfully okay friends that's it all about this video what I wanted to show you the pagination and the flash messages now if you like such a videos don't forget to subscribe to my channel like the video share with your friends and see you in the next one all the best thank you very much